ਦੀ ਸੁਨਾਵਾ ਇੱਕ ਵਾਰੀ ਗੱਲ ਸੁਣ ਜਾ ਅੱਖਾਂ ਨਾਲ ਮਿਲਾਉਂਦੀ ਲੱਖਰੇ ਦਿਖਾਂਦੀ ਗੱਲ ਸੁਣ ਜਾ ਨਹੀਂ ਲੱਭਣਾ ਮੇਰੇ ਵਰਗਾ ਨੋ ਨਹੀਂ ਲੱਭਣਾ um the journey has been pretty intense on and off um i've spent a lot of time in the studios on the couch in the car waiting to be let in um pretty emotional but i learned a lot made me who i am today um you know i i made a lot of friends i lost a lot of friends um i actually remember when i first started i was under a different name called zk i released a couple of tracks locally um and then i decided to go back to university and study but now i came back uh, with a new name fresh start <laughs> So I first started as a musician, uh singer on YouTube, uh singing covers and also writing my own songs. I was also, you know, developing and writing and producing songs for lots of other bands and artists over in America or in the UK as well as some in India as well. So I was I've always been used to being in the studio and working. I was then asked by a record company T series to start creating some fusion type stuff, um you know, maybe some remixes with some of their catalog. um and obviously at first i was a little bit apprehensive uh, it's not something that i've ever done i'm a little bit rusty as well in the language and the native tongue but um you know i trusted them their experience and i trusted kizo as well who i work with um and um you know try to create my own spin on it because it has been done for decades now um so it, it's tough to be able to do something and obviously do it justice as well the success of those songs then allowed me to release my own independent material songs like nakre and queen so um you know it was all for a good cause really um i'd say bruno mars people like asho have been emulating for so long um you know you've got og singh mohammed irfan um i actually did my own version of dard dilo by mohammed irfan um which hopefully i should be able to be releasing soon as well um and also i love uh, gabi jobado in fact i remember performing it at a show once and i remember the crowd responded so well to it and i i kind of instantly fell in love with it as well after they requested it well i love people i love meeting people um who listen to my music who supported me um and ultimately who can relate to the experiences that i've been through um so there's never really any special moment for me just being able to continue making music on a daily basis is special enough and being able to do it on independently is you know it's it's so difficult in this day and age uh, i wanted to work with uh, mohammed ifan big fan of his voice from banjara and the first song dar dilo which i also thinking about doing like a remix of um it was you know it, we didn't quite finish this we didn't quite get to work on the song together um but nonetheless i was i was honored to even have the opportunity to even be considered um i can't compare both platforms the international music scene is is massive uh, how much support we do have in our own community um and especially with all the remixes and some of the um tracks i did in punjabi and hindi i you know i have to say my own territory my own uh, my own turf has to be my favorite right now the indie music scene is vibrant i think it's the next big thing in the mainstream industry um and it's exciting times mere paas tu aaj tere ranj ban jaav ke re gal sang diye hiriye ai labna mere bar ga no